Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Ziggy Sandy. Today we're going to be diving into the topic you are doing better than you think. I know it's the end of the year. It's usually the time where we start to reflect on our lives. We start to reflect on the year so far. And sometimes we often find ourselves talking down on ourselves, feeling down because of goals and aspirations that we have that we haven't fulfilled yet. And then we start to compare our lives lives with other people's lives so i'm just here to remind you that you are actually doing better than you think if you like videos like this please like this video right now we can go ahead and get into the video shall we first i'm going to remind you to learn to acknowledge your progress it doesn't matter how little the progress is if you plan on doing something this year and you were able to do a little bit of it even if it's things like weight loss um, starting a youtube channel getting that degree whatever it is you know it's easy to get into the hustle of life and we forget how far we've come take a moment to acknowledge how far you've come maybe you went through some challenges this year and you were able to overcome it acknowledge that the tiny little things maybe you set out this year you want to wake up at a certain time maybe you say I want to wake up 6 a.m. this year and you were only able to wake up 7 o'clock maybe usually you wake up 9 a.m. you're getting a little closer to your goals so next year you can do better but this year whatever it is you went through challenges maybe you applied for a job you got rejected give yourself a pat on the back for at least trying you tried you applied for the job so you give yourself a pat on the back next year you try again whatever it is you set out to do this year maybe you were only able to achieve just a little bit of it you need to acknowledge it and give yourself a pat on the back for me this year i have been talking about youtube 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 i want to do youtube i want to do youtube and just towards the last few months of the year i started taking it a little bit seriously so i gave myself a realistic goal because i have a toddler i'm taking care of so i i told myself i want to try and at least post one video every week and within the last few months leading up to now if you check my channel you can see that i've been posting a video every week and then random videos on my shorts that doesn't mean i don't have other goals that i set out to do this year i went through a lot this year but i did not allow it to stop me from acknowledging the little ones that i've been able to accomplish so i'm admonishing you today to do the same thing instead of focusing on the things that you couldn't accomplish focus on the things that you were able to accomplish yeah so don't underestimate or undermine the little wins when you acknowledge the little things that you accomplish it will put your mind in a positive light and then you can accomplish the bigger things instead of looking at the things that you couldn't accomplish this year and feeling like a failure look at it and tell yourself you know what I'm alive, the new year is coming, I'm gonna give it a try again. You keep trying, as long as you're alive, you just keep trying. And whatever it is that you've accomplished already, you, you know, count your blessings. The second one is celebrate small wins. I've already said it before, every little goal that you're able to accomplish, even as little as waking up at a certain time in the morning and now you're doing it, it's worth celebrating don't ever underestimate or look down on your achievements the tiny little achievement goes a long way because for you to get to this big goal that you've set for yourself you have to take little baby steps to get there so applaud yourself for the little things that you've accomplished already third is overcoming challenges the fact that you're still here the fact that you made it through whatever it is whatever challenges that you went through i went through some challenging moment this year that could have broke me each day i pick myself back up i encourage myself and i keep going and so the fact that you're still here it's the end of the year you're here you're excited for the new year that's another reason to celebrate i know what i'm saying so far i'm starting to sound maybe a bit redundant but trust me you have to 
celebrate the little things and the fact that you were able to go through those challenges because when you're going through challenges sometimes you feel like oh i can never get through this i can never come out of it but you did come out of it you are here you are alive um there are many people who slept last night and they are not alive this morning and so the fact that you're here you're watching this video that's what celebrating and be hopeful be in the mind space of gratitude like this morning i woke up and i thought about some things i was just feeling grateful that i'm doing the things that i love and i don't have to worry about certain things i don't have to worry about roof over my head i don't have to worry about what meal i'm going to eat regardless of what you've been through or what you're going through you have to find a way to put yourself in the my space of gratitude because when you're grateful for the little things that's when bigger things can happen to you and that leads me on to the last part gratitude for support i know none of us is living life alone if you are living life alone i am sorry that you have to live life alone but reach out to the people that are around you or family members that you have try to reach out to someone for a lot of us we did not live life alone i don't think i can survive life alone we are not meant to live life alone learn to appreciate those that have been able to support you maybe it was a time in your life that you needed someone to talk to and you caught that person and the person picked up the phone and they listened to you they listened to your rant try to appreciate that person you don't have to buy a gift you can just call just give some words of appreciation we're not meant to do life alone and so for those people in your life that have been supportive whatever it is that you're doing and you have people that are supporting you try to appreciate them that you don't have to buy any gift but a gift is nice but you don't have to in a nice text showing how much you appreciate them goes a long way think about those people in your life that are always there in times of needs or they are always in your life cheering you on think about those people and be grateful and show your gratitude to them so as we wrap up this year i want you to think about the highs the lows think about everything reflect do whatever you need to do if you need to go on hiatus for a few days to journal your thoughts um speak to god whatever you need to do reflect and end it with a heart of gratitude be grateful to be alive be hopeful for the new year i do pray that whatever it is that you desire that in this new year it will come to pass if you like this video so far you have someone in your life that you want to send words of encouragement to just send them this video please like this video i do pray that we all see the new year that all our dreams and aspirations that we have the strength the mental capacity the inner strength and the resources to bring everything to light and yeah so please like share subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye bye if you've been able to take a step just a little bit of step to take you oh god have mercy